so we can also use language properties file for internationalization or other purposes so we can fetch these details like this first name and last name this from language properties file so just create a property file So I am giving phone as telephone number and use this in our display. So first in more entry in portlet.xml. So after support just provide this path and that's it. So now we need to fetch in our view.jsp. We are using language util class for this. Let me just delete this. So just import this so properties phone and name come from our property file so this phone goes to this and it will print telephone number as a header so now look the header is telephone number next thing we can do in our this is provide a condition like this is gender and gender is m or f m represent for male and f for female so we can provide a condition here like if gender is m then this means it's a male otherwise it's a female so name is gender and value is if gender is m then it's male otherwise it's a female we can also provide value as like this is properties in last name and this. so I can use like this if you want to provide some other bit thing with name so like like I want to print Mr. So now we can use header as last name and provide value as Mr. Dot this. So this is also very useful in some of the scenarios. So let me just check both the condition male and female in this. So deploy this. So look, if M for male and otherwise it's a female and last name as Mr. Bhardwaj and Mr. Sharma and Mr. Gupta. So these two are also successful. You can also use CSS in our columns. So like I am using CSS for standard. So let me just provide some condition and on the basis of this condition we will check this. So I am using if student dot standard less than 4 then CSS class is blue otherwise CSS class is green. So I am using this C tag so first let me just provide this in our properties file. So open language package dot properties and add gstl. So now JSTL is applied. Now our tag is complete. I just need to write the CSS classes. So 
let me just open my CSS folder and open main.css. So it's simple. If CSS blue means color blue and CSS green means green color. So this is my CSS classes. So let me deploy this. And look, the color is blue and green. Look, the 6 and 5 are green and 4 is blue. So our CSS is also applied. 